Hello and welcome to Reader's Retreat. I'm Paul and this is the NFL challenge that uh, Erica Nightmare, uh, Paul aka Frostbite and myself is doing. And uh, we do put the uh, these videos on our own channels and then when we uh, talk about the uh, you know, pet pe pecking on. We do all the picks over on sports and cigars talk. So come over, check out sport uh, sports and cigars, and uh, we'll see how that goes. Now we'll see if you like it. Uh, when, and anybody can join. Any, anybody can join. Right now, we're up on week seven, which is January of next year. And uh, in, anybody can, uh, you just get hold of me or uh, Paul, a.k.a. Frostbite, and uh, we'll explain everything to you. So, but the uh, first book, now I'm going to, I picked. The team for all 13 games of this week. We're only having 13. And uh, I, 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 and what we do, we assign, assign books to every team. So, this time, uh, is this January? No, this is for February. Sorry. This is for February, not January. This here is for February. Week seven is for February. Sorry, and uh, there's 13 games, and if and once I pick, I'm picking them to win. So uh, if they lose, I have to read a book. So Jags, if they lose, I have to read Ash and Silver by Carol Bird. Never read nothing from her. I know this is probably a uh, yeah. This is a part of the series, and I. And the thing is, I've never found any more of her series, and I want to see if I like the way she writes anyway. So if I do, I'll probably be on the hunt for that. Okay, I picked the Lions to win, so if they lose, I'm reading Ted Decker's Showdown, which is the first book of the trilogy, and yes, I do have all three books uh so uh let me try to keep these marked uh let's see okay i picked the bears to win if they lose i'm thinking i I'm, i might have a couple of these mixed up but i'm gonna try my best but you know Dean Coots, The City. Okay. Uh, the next one, is, I picked the, believe it or not, I picked the Browns to win. And if they lose, I'm going to read Blaze by Richard Buckman, a.k.a. Stephen King. There you go. Uh, let me go ahead and mark that so I know that I'm right there. Patriots. I picked the Patriots to win. And if they lose, I'm going to be reading The Intern by Michelle Campbell. This is a new book that came out September of 2023. And I am uh, wondering if I'm going to enjoy it or not. I don't know much about it. And I could read the, the synopsis. But I ain't going to. So that's how that goes. Okay, I picked the uh, Washington to win, and if they lose, I have to read Kim Harrison's American Demon. And you all know I enjoyed. I've been enjoying that series. And if the Falcons. 
losers because I picked him to win. If the Falcons loses, I have to read this uh, cozy mystery by Erlene Fowler, Broken Dishes. So, I know I don't put on up very many cozy mysteries, but I do read cozy mysteries every once in a while. Okay, now we got, uh, I picked the Rams to win, and if they lose, I'm going to be reading the fourth book in the Dark Tower series by Stephen King, Wizard in Glass. See, I'm not scared of big ones. Uh, so, there you go. The Seahawks. If the, I picked the Seahawks to win. If they lose, I'm going to be reading another cozy mystery by Erling Fowler. And this one is Kansas Trouble. So, there's two cozy mysteries by the same author. So, Seahawks. I believe, I believe that's where I am. Yeah, see, if, if, well, hold on. I got four left here, so that must be for Seahawks. Okay, this is for the Seahawks. I just lost my place, that's all. And so let's mark that. That's why I've been marking them. It, I picked the Packers to win. If they lose, I'm going to be reading Sabbath. I believe it's Sabbath that I read of theirs for them. If not, I, I'll uh, correct it on next Sunday and uh, go from there. So, anyway, if 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 Packers lose, uh, that's what I'll be reading. Now, the Chiefs, I picked the Chiefs to win. If they lose, I'll be reading uh, the second book in the in Elemental Assassin book by Jennifer Estep. I'm reading uh, the first one, and this is the, set, the second one called Web of Lies. And if you like urban fantasy, I'm enjoying the first book. That's for sure. Uh, I picked the Eagles to win. They put me, they let me down this week. I'll let you know that. They let me down this week. They lost to the Jets. Oh, that was a terrible loss. But not as bad as the next team. But the Eagles, I'm picking to win. And if they lose, again, if they lose, I'm going to be reading a science fiction book. I'm not big on sci-fi, but I'll be I'll be reading sci-fi by Melissa Scott called Dream Ships. And for the last game, the 49ers. I picked the 49ers to win this past week, and they lost to the Giants. Can you believe that? To the Giants. Oh, anyway, they're playing, and I picked them again. If these if these two teams uh, did you know loses again this last week, I'm not going to pick them again. No, but the 49ers, if, if they lose, I have to read P.T. Durman Centennials of Fire. So there you go. Now, one thing I can honestly say, it's not really a punishment to read all these books, because all these books is in my on my uh, big TBR that I pick from, and I get to read them, and so I win. I lose if I don't get to read them. So think of it like that. But uh, we do uh, punish people. In this challenge, uh, it, okay, there's two ways to be punished, okay? If you're, well, it, 
just mainly one way because you'll be pet you'll be pecking teams, and uh, if you don't get like uh, November. If a person don't get all those books read in November, that they are supposed to read in November, uh, then the ne the next what time if they uh, if they uh, don't if they only didn't get to one, then uh, say me, okay? Say I don't get to one. I don't have to read none in November. I broke even for that month. But anyway, <laughs> what it is, is uh, say I have one book left and never got to or didn't get finished, then Erica or Paul gets to choose uh, a team that uh, gets to... Uh, you know, for me, out of that another week, and then if I miss two or three, that's two or three that they get to pick for me, and so on and so forth. So that's way that's what we're doing, and I hope y'all enjoyed this, and I'll get this up as soon as possible. And you guys have a good one. And I'm, and always remember, it's always a great time to read. Later.